and setting up pontoon in a river lake, anywhere like that. Great way to stop the chain and bolt the chain and you wrap it around the post so that the pontoon doesn't go floating away and can go up and down with tides or waves is actually cutting sections of thick dripper pipe or irrigation pipe. So as you can see, it all just rolls up and down the post because it's cutting sections. As opposed to a loop. You do a loop around the post and it creates wear marks on the post. So this post here and other posts likewise. <coughs> We had to put this metal here to try and stop the, the actual rubbing itself. And the chain used to grab, but now, as you can see, they just roll up and down and don't create any wear anymore. Problem solved for pontoons. This is somebody else's pontoon. Uh, before they put the um, protector hose wrapped around the chain, the chain ripped into that post. So it's done a lot of damage on that post. Easy to see. And then it's started wearing away on that post and then that's why they put the um, hose as a sleeve around it but even then the chain in this case here that chain still hooked onto the post now because the hose bit has slid around so the other method of cutting up sections allows it to roll up and down the post and then you don't get you don't get the post wearing out like this